हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय चैनल दीप इकोनॉमिक्स बाय दीपांक सो आज की इस वीडियो में वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट इंपॉर्टेंट यूनिवर्सिटी और कॉलेजेस वे यू कैन अप्लाई फॉर योर मास्टर्स प्रोग्राम इन इकोनॉमिक्स बिकॉज सी इट्स वन ऑफ द मोस्ट डिमांडिंग सब्जेक्ट एट द हायर एजुकेशन लेवल एंड देर आर मल्टीपल और यू कैन से मेनी स्टूडेंट्स हु वॉन्ट टू परस्यू एम ए पी एच डी इन इकोनॉमिक्स सो टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अ डिटेल लिस्ट ऑफ दोज इंस्टीट्यूशंस Uh, you cannot think that uh, all these institutions that we are going to discuss is in terms of hierarchy, in terms of the quality of uh, you can say the uh, degree. But then uh, you can say that yeah, more or less uh, you can you know divide the institutions among those where the entrance examinations are easy, difficult, hard. So you uh, based on those things. So uh, number one, uh, you can think of DSE. Delhi School of Economics. Uh, the entrance exam for DS is pretty difficult. Second, uh, JNU. JNU has two different MA Economics program. One is CESP, CITD. CITD is Center for International Trade and Development. So they focus on international economics. Uh, the entrance examination of CITD is a bit difficult than that of CESP. and again uh, in terms of eligibility criteria uh, they have their own separate eligibility criteria if you have not studied economics at the undergraduate level or if you have not studied mathematics then uh, i think you are not qualified for citd but then for csp irrespective of any courses you have studied at your undergrad level you are uh, pretty eligible for this course third in list is your sau south asian university so uh, the sau form has been declared and you can go and fill the entrance form i think the last date to fill the entrance form is uh, 21st of april so you can go and apply one thing that you get to uh, at sau is that uh, this institution has been created by south uh, sark nations south asian association for regional cooperation Uh, and this institution is based in new delhi the students that study over here are from different sag countries so that's the exposure that you get get at sag fourth in list so of you in a way you uh, the classification that we are we are doing you can in a way say that all those institutions are based in delhi so j m i jamia millia islamia Fifth is your uh, AUD Ambedkar University, uh, Delhi. So they have their Development Economics program. Apart from all those institutions, uh, the sixth number which we thought of, you know, discussing with you, is IIT Delhi. So uh, they have their Jam uh, IIT uh, Jam Joint Admission Test for masters program and uh, from uh, i think for the for the past two years they have been conducting they conducted in 2021 they conducted the exam in 2022 so the thing with uh, iit jam is that it's conducted in the month of uh, jan so uh, next time you if you want to apply so it will be for next academic session and not for this one so this is the issue with jam that they uh, conduct their exam in jan itself next is again isi isi is something that you are you know very much focused or specific to mathematics or statistics then only you should apply for isi and again this is the only institution uh, based in delhi where you will have to appear for your interview or you can say viva for your masters entrance examination so or after all these institutions which are not uh, based in delhi again if you you know in terms of uh, the entrance examination the hierarchy so uh, you can say at the eighth number is igidr igdr based in mumbai so this institution is indira gandhi institute institute of development research it's run and managed and operated by rbi again i think uh, you will have to appear in interview for igidr also uh number 9 is cds center for development studies 
Center for Development Studies, you can say it's a part of, you know, or you can say it's an extension of JNU Economics Department because many a times you'll see the professors, the Economics Department professors of JNU, the, they go and serve as the head of uh, CDS. And CDS is based in Kerala Trivandrapuram. Again, a beautiful place if you want to study over there, you should definitely uh, in terms of uh, apply over here. Then you have a MSE, Madras School of Economics. Uh, Madras School of Economics, you know, based in Chennai. It was started and by C. Rangrajan, who was a former RBI governor. Apart from that, again, uh, one that I missed in Delhi, again is IIFT. They have their excellent MA Economics program. Indian Institute of Foreign Trade. They conduct their own separate entrance examination. You know, so if you are focusing in Delhi, uh, if you want to stay in institutes which are located in Delhi, then you can think of IIFT. It's an excellent, uh, you know, they have excellent academic program and this, this institute is based next to JNU. Then you have a HCU. Hyderabad Central University based in Hyderabad, Pondicherry. If you are more like a person who wants to walk on the beaches in the evening, you know, you should go and join PU Pondicherry University. Then at some level you can apply for BHU also if you are from the regional institution. See the question of BHU is very much easy. But then I think from 2022 onwards, some of the institutions like BHU, Pondicherry, Hyderabad, Central University, then again uh, JNU, they have come under and in fact even Ambedkar University, Delhi, JMI, they have come under CUET. So now they are going to have their uh, common examination and based on the score of this common exam, uh, this common exam, you will be asked to apply into various universities. But still, you know, in a way you can apply for BHU. So, and finally, if you want again, uh, they, see, I think from the last five, six years, there are many central universities by the name of, like say, Central University of Gujarat, Haryana, Punjab, Jharkhand. So you can apply for all the universities also, but then this should be the last resort. First, you know, if not in this hierarchy but then first you should prefer for all these institutions so so, so the form for uh, sau has been released the form for delhi school of economics has been released so uh, admission to dsc is through duet delhi university entrance test the form has been released from uh, 6th of april so you should go and apply uh, for sau the last date is 21st of april so you should go and apply uh, there will be a common entrance examination for institutions like JNU, JMI, AUD, BHU, Pondicherry University, Hyderabad University. So you did not apply uh, separately. Matras School of Economics, as far as I know, uh, they conduct the examination along with IGNU. IGNU. So IGNU has a center in MSA through which the admission takes place. Again, uh, CDS for the last two years due to this pandemic, they have not been conducting the examination. So uh, there is a pretty chance that this year they might conduct their uh, entrance examination. They have their own entrance examination. Uh, I will have to check whether uh, I think the examination of IGIDR has been conducted. If not, we will inform you. So you can go and apply for IGIDR also. Uh, we'll be separately discussing about each and every institution about the way in which they are conducting the examination, the seed, the score. Because see, uh, what we have seen that many of the students who apply for MA in economics, there are many who want to go for UPSC. There are many who want to go for a higher studies in India or abroad, and then again there are many who want to you know go for private sector. So each of these institutions have their own scope. So you need to uh, visualize that where you want to join. Okay, someone like uh, who is applying for ISI, mathematics or statistics must be excellent. It's not just good. Good doesn't work in ISI. It must be excellent. So uh, we'll deal each and every institution separately. 
will cover about the way in which they are conducting the examination one thing let me uh, tell you in advance that most of these institutions apart from let's say igdi igdi where they might ask one or two questions in or you know written type solving the questions uh, all the examinations which have been conducting they have been conducting it's been conducted in you know objective type and uh, we have question last 10 years question for dsc gnu sau we have for 6 years for jamia we have a uh, isi 2 years paper of it exam bhu 10 years uh, hcu 10 years pondicherry 5 6 years cds 10 years question paper so if you want uh, if you want the question paper you can give us a call or send us a whatsapp message on our number it's 8448878849 and apart from that uh, if you want to know anything you can text us or you can go and uh, you know type your question in the comment section and we will try to answer those questions as soon as possible if you have any suggestions regarding what kind of uh, information you want through the video so uh, please post your comment and we will try to make videos on that also apart from that uh, we have also planned to discuss about the syllabus for the upcoming entrance examination for various universities important books important chapters because many a time you will not find everything in a single book so uh, what all uh, important books do we need to refer to for uh, each and every topic we will be discussing that in details so i hope the things that we have discussed in this video is helpful for you uh if you liked it please like the video also and subscribe if you have not subscribed till now and also share among your friends and juniors so that you know as we grow you also grow and learn so we wish you all the best thank you